Hello everyone, welcome to the 100 Q&A test. Plaintiff attorney is Mr. Manton, capital M-A-N-T-O-N. Defense attorney is Mr. Williams, capital W-I-L-L-I-A-M-S. Again, plaintiff Mr. Manton, M as in Mary, A-N as in Nancy, T-O-N. Defense is Mr. Williams, W-I-L-L-I-A-M-S. And this is going to start with defense, defense attorney questioning. Okay, ready? And then Saturdays and Sundays, you spent either patrolling Marshall Canyon or the Los Alamos and Fenter Road area. Yes, that is right. And would your time be on Saturdays and Sundays? Would it be you patrol one area, on Friday another area, or Saturday, or I mean on strike that, with? Would your patrol or your policy or procedure be that you'd go like, Marshall Canyon on Saturday, and maybe Los Alamos on Sunday? Or would it vary from time to time? It would vary on the amount of officers that we have that day. And in that particular area of Fenter Road, you know, the beat, if you will, that, that this the location where this accident happens, how many officers patrol that area on any given day? There is just one officer. And again, from January to approximately December of 11, 2011, on Saturdays and Sundays, how many times do you think it was I'm talking about your percentage. What was the percentage of the time that you spent patrolling Marshall Canyon versus Los Alamos? I would say I patrolled Marshall Canyon approximately 15% of the time. Did you say 15%? Yes. Okay, and how about Los Alamos? Obviously, 85%. Is that right? Correct, yes. And on patrol between January of 2011 and, no, December of 2011, how many times do you think it had been that you'd been by the scene of this accident on patrol? If you can give me an estimate. Do you mean prior to the collision? Before the collision, do you think it would be more than 10 times? Maybe close to 10 times. Do you think 5 to 10 would be fair? I would say 10. 10 to 15, yeah. Okay, and had you ever... Had you ever investigated an accident that happened at the intersection of Blue Water and Milligan? No, prior to the time of this accident happening. No. Have you ever investigated an accident that happened on Milligan prior to the happening of this accident? I can't recall if I investigated anything on Milligan. Milligan Highway is a long stretch. Let's say within five miles either direction of the location where this accident happened, had you investigated anything in that stretch? I can't be sure. Okay, to your memory, as you sit here today, do you have any memory of doing so? No. Let's talk about the, the, your call. 
getting called to go to the accident. First of all, this accident happened on a Sunday. I'm looking at the report. Is that right? Yes, it happened on a Sunday. What were your hours of work on that Sunday? I believe the shift started at 11.30 a.m. and went through 10 p.m. And you mentioned you were working four-day work weeks. That is correct. Okay. Did you have a partner on that date? No, I did not. Okay. Just so you know, you're going to hyphenate four day because it's describing uh, weeks. So you've got four day work weeks. You're not going to hyphenate work because you can say work weeks. But for day, you're definitely going to want to hyphenate that. Those are two adjectives describing the noun week, weeks. Okay. All right. So let's see here. We do have a word list. We've got Marshall Canyon, capital M-A-R-S-H-A-L-L. -L. Canyon, capital C-A-N-Y-O-N. -N. Los Alamos. Capital L-O-S space, capital A-L-A-M-O-S. Milligan Highway, capital M-I-L-L-I-G-A-N. Highway, capital H on highway. Blue Water, capital B-L-U-E. Water, capital W-A-T-E-R, that's two words. And Fenter Road, capital F-E-N-T-E-R space, capital R-O-A-D. And that concludes our 100 Q&A test. Good luck.